In this week's edition of Authors Revealed, our own Becky Anderson talks with B.A. Shapiro about her book, The Art Forger. In 1990, 13 pieces of art worth more than $500 million were stolen from a museum in Boston. But in the novel, one struggling artist discovers there's more than what meets the eye. Welcome to Authors Revealed, I'm Becky Anderson. I'm so excited we have B.A. Shapiro with us with her new thriller, it's called The Art Forger. So it started off as something different than what, very different. what it ended up being. Very, very different. So, so tell us where that, that initial little germ started for well, you. Well, the Isabella, Isabella Stewart yeah. Gardner germ started when I was researching my first book, Shattered Echoes. Oh. And that took place partially in the late 19th century, and that's when I met Isabella. Oh, okay. And I wanted to write a book about her, but she was so much larger than life that I couldn't quite do it. Yeah. It just yeah. was... And so I just tucked it in the back of my head. And then when the heist happened in 1990, mm -hmm. I thought, well, maybe now I can, I can do this. So the robbery that happened in 1990 at the museum and over $500 million worth of art was, was stolen. They've never solved this crime. No, they've never, never solved recovered it. these pieces. No. And I know I've, I, I read a little bit about what your theories are, but tell us what your theories are of what possibly could have happened and who were the, the perpetrators of this crime. Well. The whole thing makes no sense. If I had to guess, but it's just a guess like uh, everybody yeah, else's, sure. I think maybe it was the IRA because mm. they used paintings in the past. They were stealing paintings and holding them for ransom. That's one of the few possibilities that makes any sense whatsoever. So in all the research and the people you interviewed, what was the most surprising thing or the most quirky, interesting little piece that you found out? What I th I've always loved art, and I've always gone to museums and read books about artists and all of this, and I started interviewing a bunch of artists, mm -hmm. and I had no idea that a painting, an oil painting in the traditional style, was made up of 10, 20, 30 yeah. layers of paint. I never knew that, and yeah. it opened my eyes to, I mean, it became part of the plot and it opened up my eyes when now I see paintings. Yeah. I can see them so much differently. What a great conversation with B.A. Shapiro about her new book, The Thriller, The Art Forger. Back to you, Jen. Thanks, Becky. If you're interested in the full interview with B.A. Shapiro, visit our website at nctv17.com for a list of airtimes.